I think for a lot of the Chinese viewers, like they know you because of all your work you've done in China. You know, obviously you worked with Chris Lee, with Roy, with uh, all the big Chinese stars. But I think they don't know you as like uh, actually you are an artist as well, right? So I think I want you to give yourself a little bit of introduction on your artist project. You know, tell us more about it. Well, uh, introduction. Yep. And we're gonna try. Great. <laughs> You're really I good. Really need, I need to learn more. That's like that's as far as my my Mandarin goes. I'll teach you um, more. Yeah. Please do. Yeah. Well, but um, yeah, the artist project has been a lot of fun for me because you know I have worked with so many amazing artists and I've I just grew up wanting to make music and I didn't really care <clears throat> or be around music even. I didn't really care what capacity I was working in as long as I was near music and. Being a part of it in some way, whether I was working in the business or、mm -hmm. you know whatever, so I got lucky enough to start working with other artists and DJs and performers and helping them write songs and produce and whatever. And as part of that process, I had a songwriting session with this Dutch DJ Armin van Buren,、yeah. um, who's incredible and like one of the nicest, just kindest people you you'd ever meet. Yeah.、Um, And we wrote a song together, and he's not a singer, so I sang it. Okay. And、uh, what had happened was he called me like two weeks later and said, "Hey, do you want to stay on the song? I like your voice on it." And we were like, "Okay, I guess why not?" Yeah. And they said, "Okay, cool. So you're gonna fly out to Italy. We're gonna shoot a music video. Yeah. And then it's gonna come out, and it's gonna do all this. And every step of the way, I had no idea what was gonna happen. Yeah. I was just enjoying the ride. Right. And so when the song finally came out, it ended up going number one in the Netherlands, and it was on one of the highest radio songs like of the year there. Right. It went double platinum. And yeah. All, when all that happened, I was like, okay, well, you know, I have always just wanted to be around music and make music,、yeah. but it would be really stupid to waste this. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, then for me, the artist project became a question of. Most of my work is extremely collaborative, and I'll、mm -hmm. write a song with at least one other person, if not two or maybe three. We have, we've all seen the credits on a lot of these songs. By the time they come out, they've got nine people on them. Yes, and、yeah. that's all fine and great, and that's a process. But I was curious, what would it be like for me just to make something from the heart and just produce it and write it alone? Yeah, you know. Yeah, and so that was kind of how the artist project started, and it wasn't. About how do I, you know, make a song that supports this artist brand or、mm -hmm. fits into this marketing plan? It just was a question of what can I make that makes me feel the most deeply. It's about yourself. Yeah. 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 Exactly. And the hope is that maybe if it makes you know me feel deeply, <clears throat> out of the seven billion people out there,、right. we can find a few more who feel the same. <laughs>